everybody, Knisha the Creator here, and I am here today to review. I'm sorry, I am here today to review. I mean, not review. Why do I keep saying review? I got nothing to review. Oh, well, but anyway, I am here today to talk about a very special cartoon. I hope y'all know about this cartoon. It's called Static Shock, which was also based around a comic, which, which you know, was adapted from a comic series by the same name. Anyway, Static Shock is about this guy named Virgil Haw Hawkins. He's a normal African American boy, okay, that just happens to live in the kind of neighborhood that gets into, that has a lot of gang fights and all that stuff, and the police are lousy. Everything is lousy, but anyway, but anyway, then they, um, where was that again? Oh, the, but then one day, Virgil accident, Virgil, oh, unfortunately gets involved with the gang that promises to protect him from this guy, I forget what his name is. But anyway, hey, he's the guy who comes hot streak. I keep forgetting his real name. I always did keep calling him hot streak. I couldn't remember his real name. I always keep calling him hot streak. Anyway, the guy who became hot, hot, he, 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 whatever, whatever, you know what I mean. Anyway, when the, he gets involved with the opposite gang because of that guy who keeps messing with him. And then, because of him getting involved with that gang nonsense, the police come in helicopters. Tell me why this is the dumbest stuff ever. So, I know there are many gang fights and police have to get involved, but why the frick are they in helicopters? Freaking in helicopters, please. And then, they have the audacity to throw like a freaking missile, which hits this vial. They're very dangerous. Chemical vials all around the place. You throw a freaking missile? Are you just the stupidest people ever? That's why I am convinced that these police wanted that to happen. Because there's no other reason they would do some stupid junk like that. And anyway, they, sh they shoot that missile. It hits that thing. Purple gas is everywhere. Everybody, everybody, everybody's coughing and everything. Thing. Everything is going all out of control. The police are wearing their gas masks. That's how I'm convinced that they do that they wanted this to happen. Because why would they have gas masks? Huh? 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 Why would they have gas masks? Huh? They wanted that to happen. Because there's no reason you should have gas masks unless you knew they were going to do that. Like, like I said, these people were trying to do that on purpose. Anyway, after that, goddamn heat stroke because huh, well becomes heat stroke obviously, and then Virgil gets gets powers, gets control of static electricity, which inspires him to want to become the superhero he do, known as Static Shock. <laughs> I love his catchphrase. I put a shock to your sister. <laughs> I love the third intro to Static Shock. And I'm so happy that it's on HBO Max. I'm really happy it's on HBO Max. Because this, this is really fun. Like I really love Static Shock. I love Virgil. I love Richie. I love every, I love every character in there. Except for Heatstruck. I, I could do without him. He, he, he was always annoying the first time I watched Static Shock. Yeah, this ain't the first time I watched Static Shock. And it definitely won't be the last time I watched Static Shock. But anyway, yeah. He he always got on my nerves being this one-note villain that keeps coming back. It was so annoying. 
It was really annoying. He kept going back. I love Virgil and Richie's friendship. <laughs> It's just, it's just a pure, it, it's just, they have each other's backs. They are a really good friendship, like, like, they really are really good friends to each other. And, like, Virgil's family, like, the sister being so understanding and the father wanting to take more action to protect his, take the neighborhood and everything, it's just so inspirational. This, this cartoon is so inspirational. I'm telling you guys, y'all have not lived. Two y'all have watched the cartoon Static Shock. This thing is so good. Like, it is good. Like, it is way too good for people not to know about it. You know one thing I'm also peeved about? It's the fact that Generator Rex isn't on HBO Max, but I know for a fact that it was on Cartoon Network. It is so fit. It's so fit. Like, what? I wanted to watch Generator Rex. Now I won't be able to. That is so unfair. But at least all the other, but at least I can still watch all the other, mostly, cart most of the classics from Cartoon Network for, on HBO Max. I'm so glad about that, because that's what I really love about it. It's really good. I love it. Anyway. That's all I wanted to talk about. Let me tell you, Static Shock straight 10 out of 10. Definitely would recommend to anybody who has a West Static Shock. Let me tell you, it's got some deep stuff in there. Deep stuff. Like, you you think it's a normal kids cartoon about, about a superhero. Nope, they got deep stuff in there. They got gags. They got they got gun violence. They got... Uh, they got... Uh, like, they got so much stuff in there. You would not believe the deep junk they got in there. Like, when I first saw it, I was like, whoa. I did not expect that to happen. Oh my gosh, I really did not expect that to happen. Come on, Static Shock. There are already so many times I could get shocked. Huh? I really didn't mean to make that joke, but hey. <laughs> you know, but... Anyway, yeah, I really love Static Shock. And like I said, there's, there's too many good things about it. So, if y'all want to... If y'all are interested, go watch it. Like, if y'all see that, like, a few times while y'all checking out all the Cartoon Network shows, go watch Static Shock, because... It's really worth it, and thank you so much, HBO Max, for Static Shock, because let me tell you, that is the happiest thing. I figured out that HBO Max has one here besides Family Matters. <laughs> and also Full House, but come on, I knew Full House was going to be here. So anyway, bye.